Hi you guys, I want to show you um, an issue or an error if you even want to um, categorize it as an error, which it's not. Um, there's a mode, a viewing mode, that's called presentation and then outline mode. And I want to show you where, the, uh, where it is in the menu up here. Under view, if you go to outline, which is command or control Y, look at what happens. It shows up in a wireframe mode, okay? Now, there's another way, which is kind of not irritating, but it happens all the time that students use because they're holding the command or control key. Do you see over here, just for even right now, um, see how this icon, this eyeball icon, I know it's small, but can you see how it turned into a hollow eye? And I'm going to hold the command or control key and click on that. That's the same as going up to view preview mode. Okay, so you could be holding the command or control key and just inadvertently, watch this, click on that eyeball here, the visibility, and it'll turn into wireframe mode. Some people think it's, oops, what happened to my fills and why is everything in a stroke? It's not. It's just showing you a very simple version of wireframe and I'll explain why the ability to go into wireframe is important, but um, later when you have so much detail, um, one little hint is it speeds up the work on other things. So watch how I can um, go back to regular mode, go out of this, and you see how wireframe mode works for everything. And you see if I open up, I can actually do individual wireframe modes. Actually, um, I can't... Um, Illustrator only allows for the parent layer to be in wireframe mode. If I wanted to take one of these groups and have them be independent, I would have to create a sublayer. In other words, and I know this is a lot to show you, but do you see how I'm not allowed to take the one on the bottom left into wireframe mode? If I click on the parent layer and I make a subgroup layer, like that layer eight right there now, because I clicked on the second icon over, which creates a sublayer. If I pick up that group and put it into the sublayer, watch how I can independently turn the whole thing into wireframe, and I'm command or control clicking back on the eyeball. Or now, since I made a sublayer of this, I can actually turn that one into wireframe. So I just wanted you to see um, an issue that can arise and everybody at first gets kind of panicky. Just um, hold the command or control key to get it back to normal when you're clicking on the eyeball or go into view preview and you can change it back and forth. Okay, thank you.